Greetings, critical viewers. This is a game called One After Another. It was a game created for the 2014 Asylum Jam, which is a game jam that takes place around October, November. Uh, and this is the second year that they've done it, I believe. Basically, it's uh, a game jam, but the stipulation for all the games submitted is that they cannot have themes or environments that have to do with mental illness, such as asylums, you know, mental institutions, very common uh, things that you see in a lot of horror games. So, this is one of the higher rated titles and I'm excited to try it. Boom. I've tried a couple of uh, Asylum Jam games, but uh... Well, okay, so there are things to hide from. Hmm. Anyway, uh, you might have seen a couple of them on this channel. Uh, I think I played like uh, I, from last year's game jam. I played uh, Tempest Fugit. Uh, what else did I play? I played some sci-fi horror game too that was like seven minutes long. They were pretty cool. All right, so this is weird. So I'm no expert, but this place looks pretty asylumish to me. Particularly since our roving main character is not wearing a shirt. And there are pretty much two places where that is deemed not unusual. One of them is the beach. So, just saying, it seems pretty... That, that was pretty cool. What was that thing chasing me? Jeez! What was his problem? What? What is this? Is that a trap? Are there traps? There are traps. Great. Lots of stairs. Lots and lots of stairs. Uh, I guess let's go up. I don't know. Seems like we got to kind of... Okay, so the edge of the map is... Consistent. Seems like... Mm. What? There are two of them right there. That's not fair. Okay, bye. What? There's another one over there. Jeez, these things are relentless. I think I beat it really quick. <laughs> I see, so I was lured to my death, just like everyone before me. Is that what it was saying? Okay, let's... Hmm... What? What? That isn't even... How did I die? Okay, so we beat it super quick. <laughs> I knew it was going to be fast. I didn't know it was going to be that fast. So the proper perspective for a lot of these Asylum Jam games is just like, know that they were done under extreme time restraints. I mean, uh, as you can tell, obviously, the graphical style is pixelated, and a lot of Asylum Jam games, uh, or just Game Jam games in general, are very pixelated because there's just not a lot of time to do much else. Um, and that said, I don't mind it. How did, was it? Okay. This is horrible. I got really lucky that first time. Hi, you idiot. Wow, I see. So that's how I died. Doug, what? Those things are everywhere. I just kind of want to have a couple monster encounters before the end the video, just so everybody gets to see a little bit more of the game. That's all. I beat in like three minutes. Hmm. Uh huh. Okay, let's let's hang out with this one. Does it keep following me? Yep, definitely does. But you can't. Ah. 
That's really cool music for the chase. I really like that. Pretty jarring, especially uh, the you're safe music, because. Whoa! 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 I got stabbed to death! <laughs> well, that was a fun little game. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like it. There's a link in the description if you'd like to try this game for yourself. Uh, it doesn't look like there's a whole lot more than what I just showed you, but um, yeah, you know, if, if it interests you, might as well check it out. We'll see you guys later. Think critically.